Hello and good morning. My name is Kaylee. This is the Tea House and today uh, we just got back from the grocery store. So I'm going to show you what we got for the first week of December uh, for our grocery list. Um, this is both at Costco and King Supers. Um, but first, let me show you our meal plan for the week. So here is my trusty whiteboard. Uh, my meal plan for the week includes all of the um, items that are on the left. And then my grocery list is what I needed in order to make those things, as well as anything else that we needed on the right. So um, we actually already had one of our meals, which is why there's that blank spot up on top. Um, we had that last night. So uh, the remaining three meals for the week are cod, vegetables, and rice, which we are having tonight. Hot dogs and tater tots we have uh, on there as well. And then carnitas, which is going to be um, a dinner. And then I'm also going to make a freezer meal as well from that. And then next week we have a ham roast and garlic butter beef tenderloin pasta on the list. Um, in terms of my grocery list, typically the stuff on the top is what we need from Costco. The stuff on the bottom, uh, the lemons, starting at lemons and gelato sauce and heavy cream is what we would typically get at King Supers. And then dog food we get at an entirely different location. So let's see how we did and see how many things that I bought on impulse. All right, so starting over here, I have Cheez-Its. So instead of Goldfish, Cheez-Its were on sale today, so I got Cheez-Its. These Thinster dark chocolate coconut cookies. Okay, so we got them when they were on discount. They were not on discount, but I still got a bar, or, uh, still got a bag. These are so good. Crunch these up, put them over ice cream. Oh my goodness. Life! Um, so we typically don't do a ton of cereal, but going into December, we know that we are going to have a new baby and we will need some very quick and easy uh, breakfasts. So I did get this. This was on sale and they didn't have our go-to, which is Honey Bunches of Oats. Uh, the Borson um, was on sale. It was a three pack for, I want to say like five or six dollars. I can check. Or, you know what, I'll just put the prices. Borson was $3 off and it's normally $9. So, um, we use this in pastas and um, we typically don't ever, like, use it just as crackers and, and to dip. But, um, super, super, super yummy and adds great flavor to pasta dishes. We have two gallons of whole milk. Uh, we got organic blueberries. They did not have any organic apples, so this was the um, best price for apples. This was, I think, four pounds for just over four dollars. So we got those. Uh, sour cream. We are all out of sour cream. I have made my own sour cream in the past using Bec Becky from the Acre Homesteads recipe, but it's it's just not in the cards <laughs> lately. Um, for our vegetable this week. Um, I was hoping that they had heavy cream, and I didn't get heavy cream. Uh, they were out at both Costco and King Supers. I was going to make creamy mushrooms, um, but I will find a use for these. So they won't go to waste. My husband mentioned uh, a couple days ago that we have not had cauliflower in a while. And I looked for fresh cauliflower, but they didn't have any. So I picked up this multicolored cauliflower. I thought that this would be a good option to try to get. Uh, the little lady to eat some vegetables. Maybe if it's fun colors, she would be more inclined. Fingers crossed, right? Um, I got a pack of 12 hot dog rolls. This is for dinner uh, tomorrow. Uh, one of the dinners on the list, hot dogs and tots. Um, we needed those. And then um, they had their uh, Aunt Hattie's um, hamburger buns back in stock. So I got a pack of these. They're only like two or three dollars. Um, and they freeze really, really well. So these will be going in the freezer. Uh, we also got the wrap size tortillas, again, with little man come in. We just want to make sure that we have uh, easy lunches and quick snacks available. So that's why we got those. Uh, we needed a couple more loaves of bread. So there is that. And the last two things from Costco, um, they did not have brown eggs, so I did get um, just the normal white eggs. Um, and then um, if you saw my Azure Standard haul 
you know that I did not get my 25 pound bag of uh, organic sugar. So I picked up a, I think this is a 10 pound bag. Yes, 10 pound bag of sugar from Costco just to tide us over for the holidays. Now on to my King Supers haul. Um, so I got three cans of enchilada sauce, uh, one green and two red. We'll be using one of these to make uh, carnitas enchiladas with the rest of the uh, carnitas, um, but the other two are going to go on our garage pantry shelves. Uh, I have four, I find it funny, these are called large limes. Really? Large, large limes? Really? Okay. Uh, so we have four limes and four lemons and two uh, big heads of garlic and then an impulse buy because everyone needs a donut in their life. So we are onto the grand totals of what did we spend? Um, shockingly, we spent $12.58 at King Supers for just those couple items. Um, and we spent $95.42 at King uh, Costco. So we did a great job at Costco um, and not great job at King Supers, but prices are going up and, you know, things are out of stock. Um, a couple of things that we were not able to find. Um, oh, I didn't even look for salsa. Darn. Um, that is the small issue and all I do is just take a picture of my grocery list. Sometimes I forget things. That's okay. We do have green tomato salsa. Uh, in the ref refrigerator, um, and if we need more salsa, we can just go get more. Uh, peanut butter. They were all out of peanut butter. Um, they did have Skippy, but I prefer to do an all-natural option. Um, and they, if, if they would have had like Skippy Natural or something like that, I would have gone with that, but they didn't. Um, and then the heavy cream. So um, the garlic butter <coughs> tenderloin pasta has heavy cream as an option, um, but I think that because I got the Borsin, I can substitute some heavy cream and maybe go to the store next week and see if they have some. Otherwise, I can use some like half and half or something else to get us over. So, uh, thank you so much for joining me today on this grocery haul for the beginning of December. If you feel so inclined, I would love for you to like and subscribe and uh, join for more videos in the future. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask in the comments. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.